up everyone welcome back to the channel i'm back out here on trail doing tabletop and phelps today i'm on the van hovenberg trail right now uh i'm gonna make a stop at indian falls because it's just a little past the uh, tabletop junction so it's worth stopping you get a nice view of the mcintyre range at the top of the falls so uh yeah i'm gonna do that and then i'm gonna do tabletop first uh but it's gonna be a beautiful day Nice and sunny, no clouds, about 60 on the summit. So it's just perfect. All right, first junction, McIntyre Range that way and Marcy Dam this way. About 2.2 miles to Marcy Dam from this junction. All right, here at Marcy Dam, I just crossed over the bridge to the other side. And we're coming up to the dam right now. Good morning. Good morning. This is incredible. Trail Junction for Avalanche Pass that way and Marcy this way along the Van Hovenberg Trail. This is my first time being on this section of the trail after um, the junction for Avalanche Pass. It's quite beautiful. Got the Phelps Brook down there along the trail. Had to cross it as well. It's just a really nice area up here. All right, here it is. The junction for Phelps. I'm gonna come back to this mile to the top tabletop is about the same with uh roughly 1200 feet of gain um so yeah i'm gonna knock that out first because it's the furthest and then come back and hit phelps so one thing i forgot to mention back there at the junction for phelps is that from the trailhead it's roughly 3.6 miles so that's what you can expect up to that point um so far I've just gained under a, about a thousand feet. So I would say to the junction, maybe 845, 850 feet or so. So not bad at all. Like I said, it's a very gradual ascent and you can definitely cruise it. All right, got a nice little bridge here. Roughly 3.7 miles in, crossing over the Phelps Brook. It's really nice. Starting to get a little steeper. Got some stairs up ahead. All right, here's the next junction. Van Hovenberg Ski Trail. To the left and then to the right is just the hiking trail. Here 
the yellow junction for tabletop. So just up there, about a mile, 1,200 feet again. I'm gonna go to Indian Falls first. further Indian Falls. Incredible view of the McIntyre range and then Colden. You can see Colden's south summit. It's beautiful. Back at the junction for tabletop. Man, <laughs> Indian Falls was incredible. I've seen pictures and uh, videos of it, but it just is incomparable to in person. It was absolutely beautiful. But yeah, making my way up tabletop. It's about 1,200 feet of gain, so it's gonna be a nice, consistent climb once. We uh, reached the steepest part, but it shouldn't be too bad, especially now that I've had a nice little break. But yeah, onwards and upwards. All right, tabletop trail. <laughs> what a difference this trail is. Super narrow, very rugged, lots of mud. And so the climb begins. I've reached the steep section, well, the beginning of the steep section of uh, the tabletop trail. This, uh, there is such a distinct difference in the trail. It's uh, really incredible though. There it is, high peak number 37, uh, tabletop. I got a nice view of Marcy, Basin, Haystack, Colden, the McIntyre range. Absolutely incredible. Um, didn't do too much filming up at the top, giving people their space. There's a few other people up there, so. Yeah, well, heading down to the junction now and gonna get Phelps.
right, back at the junction. And that's about 0.9. Back down to Phelps Junction. And then we'll head up. All right, here it is. Phelps Junction. One mile. Well, let's go. These views are incredible. <sighs> wow. Getting close to the summit. Perfect spot right here. That was it, Phelps Mountain, high peak number 38. I got eight more peaks to go. This one was incredible. Tabletop right there, that's where I just was. The view from there was nice, but this one was certainly <laughs> way better. But yeah, incredible views here. All right, so from the true summit, you can see the entire Great Range and uh, Big Slide and uh, Giant and Rock Peak Ridge, but from here, we got Gothics right there, Saddleback, Basin, uh, Haystack is behind, Tabletop, then we got Marcy, Gray, Colden right there, the Northeast Summit, I believe it's that one right there, I was saying South Summit earlier, but it's the Northeast, there you got Avalanche Pass right there, Avalanche Mountain, McIntyre Range, Straight back there, we got the Santanonis, Seward's right there, Street and Nye, uh, Lost Pond Peak right there, and then just behind that, you can actually see the Sawteeths, which is kind of cool. But 
yeah this is just an incredible view and then right here we got tr mountain teddy roosevelt mountain absolutely incredible this definitely ranks up towards the highest for uh for the mountains i've done so far all right well that's it i'm gonna end the video here um cruise back down so yeah if you guys are liking the videos the content be sure to like them um subscribe to the channel if you want to stay in touch with uh, every video i put out immediately when i put it out you'll get a notification for it uh but yeah thanks for watching my videos guys see you out here next time i'm gonna do dial nipple top and saw teeth next week um so yeah it should be a fun trip but stay tuned for that one see you guys